Hello, we are Team 9. Here we have our 3D filament splicer. It is intended to reduce waste and needless spending by allowing users to fuse together 3D filaments that may otherwise be discarded. We created our prototype from easy to obtain parts, including stepper motors, filament extruders, a heating core, an LCD display, a rotary encoder, and an Arduino. We also designed and 3D printed the case ourselves. The LCD display is used to control all aspects of the splicer. Here we have the main menu, which includes the option set temp and start. The arrow indicates which is selected. The user can click the rotor encoder, which is the black button, to enter the secondary page for a menu item. This is the set temp page, in which the user chooses the temperature the heating element will heat up to during the fusing process. Rotating clockwise increases the value by one degree, and if the user wants to change the value by a large amount, they can double click the encoder. Rotating then increases the value by increments of five. Clicking the encoder again allows the user to return to the main menu. After setting the desired temperature, the user can put the new filament into the stepper motor on one side and the old filament into the stepper motor on the other side. The motors control the movement of the filament within the heating chamber and is also used to roll the filament out of the splicer after the process is finished. Now the device is ready to begin splicing the two pieces of filament together. The user can rotate the encoder to select start on the main menu page. When the user clicks on start, the heating element will begin heating up and the LCD will display a secondary page that updates the temperature as it increases. The goal is to heat the filaments so that they are soft enough to fuse together, but not so soft that they deform. The display is reading that the temperature is going beyond our set temperature of 160 degrees Celsius, so now the cooling process will initiate. The fans then spin, causing the temperature to drop quickly, as you can see on the display. As the plastic begins to harden, the stepper motors oscillate the filaments back and forth to help fuse them together. After the process is complete, the stepper motors automatically roll out the now fused filament. and you can click the encoder one more time to return to the main menu. Now the process is complete. 